basically uh, uh, this vocational training activities we have around 160 people with disabilities being trained in uh, 10 different trades uh, trades include uh, uh, computers computer related uh, uh, services then fabrication and welding pottery ceramics uh, gardening and nursery bakery confectionery tailoring embroidery then electronic assembly so the the training is chosen and designed to meet the individual needs of the uh, people with disabilities after the assessment see technological specs there is a segment here on computers there is a segment here on fabrication so it, I would say we are not lacking on technologies. As I told you earlier, what is more important is developing the infrastructure further where we can give them in totality in-house capacities. And, and the areas where we have been working, there, can be, uh, that, uh, there is a scope to upgrade them and then you know, add on to the, uh, uh, the existing uh, 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 of technology. It's, see, these kids, it's not that they demand something. They have to be groomed in the fashion where probably looking to their IQ or looking to their mental yes, status, yes. we probably NASIO defines in what direction would be the right direction for them. They are not those who demand. Trust me, children from the big houses or children from people from like our houses are those capacities where they demand. It's not about taking a step forward. Uh, Mr. Shetty would probably agree with me. I'm already associated to them since a couple of years by now. Uh, the thought now running in my mind is very loud and clear. Why not, as you rightly said, it's about providing them a platform where they can get a better tomorrow after they are through the curriculum. Yeah, that's what we are now focusing on. Okay, they should and they deserve to get a better tomorrow for sure. That's the thought. Basically, we want to take it forward in the right direction. <laughs> For more news and gossip, don't forget to subscribe to Bollywood Helpline.